Well, today's opening morning. We're gonna head over to the spot me and dad scouted yesterday. And uh, we didn't actually hear anything when we first went there, but we drove back over there about, oh, seven o'clock-ish, going on seven. And sure enough, they were in the same spot that they were the week that I scouted them. So that's, that's some good news. I'm just excited it's opening day. Turkey season's finally here. Uh, it's going on 5.15 right now, so I don't know. We I went in there yesterday and I kind of cleared out a spot for us to sit because we're going to be awfully close to them and I didn't want to make any noise. I wanted to be as silent and as be as silent as possible and not let them know our presence is there. So, But anyways, Wyatt's going to get in here and we're going to hit Turkey Woods.
Best turkey hunts I've ever been on, dude. Dude, uh, they uh, dude. two in the back, dude. They were some freaking thunder chicken. <laughs> Holy crap. He's flat and he ain't <laughs> Dude, I can't believe that happened. Oh my. Dude, that was awesome. <laughs> that turkey's got four. <laughs> <laughs> That's an old freaking oh, turkey. Oh, thank you, Lord. Holy crap. I grabbed my pants because I was looking and I said, like, bam, he's right I there. I know, he's an old bird too, dude. Oh man, well see, yesterday me and dad, I don't know what time it is, I'm gonna check real quick. It's 6.43. I think that's the earliest I've ever killed a turkey. And yesterday it was brown, like 6.40. Scary. <laughs> scared me. But yesterday, <laughs> yesterday me and dad, we, we come over here, it's like around 6.45ish. They didn't hardly gobble on the roost we were here early, but we come over here and one little peep out of the call and they gobbled in here. And I knew right then we need to be here this morning. We got in here early this morning, we busted a hen out of the roost. I was kind of ticked off because I wanted to get in here early just in case that happened, but dude, I cannot believe that just freaking happened. That is, that is one of the best turkey hunts I've ever been on. Can't stop the flop. Nope. <coughs> Wish he'd have done that and they were over there. <laughs> I know. Floored him instead of waiting 20 minutes. I was going to try to see if the other two were going to come in, but... They, they kept working this way. They kept working, hand. yeah, towards that hen, and he kind of peeled off and started this way, but... Man, oh, Bob, he strikes again. <laughs> That's yeah. two this wee year we've killed over top of him. Man. That's freaking strutter, I'm telling you, it worked. <laughs> I know. Last year we struggled, if you guys don't remember, we struggled trying to kill him over a decoy. But this year we made it happen. Well, Wyatt, go pick him up. <laughs> <laughs> Where's 
You're good. Yeah, just wait a second. He has some thick old spurs. Does he? They're not very long, they're just thick. Oh man. <laughs> it's the pot it's close to twenty five pound turkey. <laughs> Dude, he, he might be 25 pounds. He's at least 24. Oh, yeah. All day. Heck yeah. <laughs> Dude, that was one of the best turkey hunts ever. He does have some fat old spurs on him. Good beer. That turkey's seen a thing or two. Yeah. Oh, my God. I have fun carrying him to pick up. I'm putting him in my vest. Heck yeah. That's gonna go find another one real quick. <laughs> <coughs> Man. That's what scouting does. If you're gonna the biggest tip you can give any kind of turkey hunter out there is to do your homework and scout. Because if you don't know if you don't have the turkeys, you're not gonna kill the turkeys, and if you're not where they want to be, you're not gonna get any you're not gonna have any luck either. So it's best just to do more homework than it is to hunt, really. Yeah. But um most of the time during the season, as the season progresses, the more we hunt, the more prospecting we do, the more turkeys we find, the the more knowledge we gain to where, okay, well, that turkey, he's over there today. That's where we'll be tomorrow. Or we'll try to make a big loop and get in front of him or something along those lines. But this morning, two weeks ago, or actually three weeks ago when I was scouting, they were in this bottom right here this little vat this you know, it's just a clearing when the well, it used to be real thick but it flooded and washed all of it out and now it's a perfect green strip through here that these turkeys are using because typically they're out in this bottom field well this year yeah. they've been in here if we wouldn't have done if i wouldn't have done any scouting i would have set up in that bottom field and we'd have been missing out because they'd have been in here so <coughs> <coughs> but other than that, we're still got them up there. On the road. Yeah. But that that's just that's what scouting does. So but hey. Spring 2020, it's uh, turkey season. It's, it's turned out to good. it's going so far so good. And the crazy thing is we had snow, what, four days ago? Today's like Monday. Two. Three days ago. We had about two inches of snow on the ground, so but man, I'm I'm super pumped about this. Now we just got to grab some photos, go for, try to find me one, and uh, maybe I'll fill my tag today. <laughs> I kind of hope not, because I want to keep hunting. But at the same time, I mean, I'm not going to complain. <laughs> we took the whole freaking. Twenty-three hit. Hit twenty-three. Yeah. Yep, twenty-three. I'd say. 